Hello, this is Breuer, and welcome back to another episode of our Let's Play for Farming Simulator 22 as we continue our bacon and eggs run here on Elm Creek. Just finished up planting our barley. So now we gotta go pick up our plow, well, cultivator, and go take care of that. Actually, I think it's a subsoiler. What is it actually called? Uh, what am I looking for? There we go. Subsoiler. So, technically a subsoiler. Definitely the slowest part of this process is getting all this plowed back up after each corn harvest, but thankfully it's only the two fields. Alright, let's get you going. Let's go ahead and get our trailer over here. Get this guy emptied out a bit. We're getting quite a bit of corn, which is nice. We still have so much corn. <laughs> All right, get you parked here for a minute. Make sure you're doing all right. Please don't go into the next field. Hey, eh, you're turning around. Good job. All right, we're going to put a little skip in here. We'll be back once we're a little bit further along. 
All right, we're back. We finished up the first field. Are working on the second field with both the plow. Well, again, subsoiler. I'm gonna I'm gonna use those interchangeably. Forgive me. Um, as then the harvesters over there as well. I just picked up a little bit more manure just to kind of go get that dropped off while we had the trailer temporarily empty. Ah, I knew there was another sign over here. I just didn't see it. There it is. Why is it not? Oh, I'm in the wrong spot. I was like, I'll be all right, guys. <laughs> I'm like trying to back up to a wrench, not the actual drop-off spot. There we go. Looks like you're almost done. You are doing all right. Let's get you to go be ready to pick up the last of the corn. How many total pigs do we have? One, two, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So we have 90 pigs. So that means we can hold two more sets, 18 more. And the next batch will be coming next month. That means we can hold one more after that. Um, which won't be coming for four months. Hmm, which does mean that yeah, we will actually go over. We, we will cap out. I guess I did my math wrong somewhere along the way. I mean, we'll cap out if we keep this particular pin, obviously, once we grow up to the bigger one. We'll have a little bit more room before we start capping out. But I thought I, thought I did my math properly that we weren't going to cap out right away. But it looks like I might have been off by one cycle. Gotta get ready to herbicide these two fields next month and sell the eggs.
We won't need this header for a bit. The next header we will use will be the other one. So we'll just drop this off over here. Alright, get you ready to go, and then we just gotta wait for the plowing to finish, and we're good to fast forward. Oh, I did do the math. Uh, I went ahead and fast forward one full hour of today, just so I can get an idea of how much um, food we're gonna be eating. And we're eating about, I think, 2,000 liters of food right now. So we have just enough to make it one more day with the pigs. Uh, for the base food, that is. Um, we'll still have a little bit extra grain in there, a little, a little bit of protein crops. We may have to decide if we want to throw in a little bit more food just to kind of get them all evenly emptied out or not. Truth be told, though, we might need to just go ahead and get this done because we're going to get to the point soon where we run out of space for the pigs like we just mentioned. Decide where we wanted to put it. I think the plan was just to put it facing it as it is currently. And then, uh, call that good enough. Something like, I don't know, something like that maybe. And leave the manure pit where it's at. Because I'm assuming once we sell this other thing, that manure pit will still be usable. Technically, we could temporarily overlap these. Um, and uh, once we sell the other one, it should be fine, I think. I don't know, something like that. I might move it over so that that slurry is like right on the road itself, but I think something like that will be fine. Yeah, we'll make it work. Obviously, we don't have the money right now. Uh, we do need to, uh, uh, once this guy gets done, we need to move some stuff around if we're going to do that here next month or so. All right, that is good for now. Like I said, we can go ahead and fast forward. The pigs will be fine for another month. The chickens, I think, will be okay for another month of grain. So let's go ahead and get that fast forwarded and ready to do what's next. Part of that being selling some eggs.
All right, get you rolling. Let's go get you to pick up the trailer for the eggs. Not a lot of eggs, barely worth the trip, but we'll go ahead and get them sold off and be all right with that. Actually, I don't know where they're going to be selling to at the moment. Uh, let's see, we want to go down here. Uh, looks like the farmer's market uh, and it is going down, so we want to go ahead and get there. Did you really go the wrong direction? <laughs> I didn't I didn't put a border there because I'm like, no, nah, he's got this. He's smart enough to turn left. Apparently I give you too much credit, my friend. That's alright. We're here to rescue you. I mean there were technically war weeds on that field to your right, but still. you headed up this way i'm going to take a look at the animals make sure they're okay for a second um chickens still doing good how many more chickens do we get one two three four five six seven so we're at 210 chickens and what can hold three actually i don't remember 360 okay so we got we got quite a few more chickens to come along which is fine actually very good for us that gives us even more eggs along the way and then the sheep or the sheep the pigs several reproducing in three months so that's gonna be yeah we got the one, one two three four so we're gonna have 36 more pigs coming along here in three months that's a lot of piggies base food is down um Still got a lot of the other ones, so I guess we will need to add in some base food. Just to kind of make things okay. I mean, until, until we get closer to the pigs reproducing again, we can hold off on the bigger pig sty for now. At least give it a couple more months to drain as much of that as we can. That'll be good. Uh, how much do we need? I mean, it's, if we're going to match the grain, we need a lot, but I don't think we're going to waste our time with that. Like I said, if we got, basically we got two more months, two more months before we grow, outgrow this pen, uh, which means we need about 4,000 more base food, maybe around 3,000 actually. And that'll drain the rest of that stuff enough to, uh, I think we'll be fine with that.
Thankfully this time next year we'll have quite a few more pallets than this. Our multiplier currently. We're at nine, we're at the full fifteen percent. Nice. Nine hundred bucks, I will take it. You're good. Let's get you parked away. I should park this off to the side since we're going to be uh, changing things up here very soon. All right, get that out of the way. Um, let's grab the trailer to get some food. What about straw? I think the straw's been going down at about the same rate. Yeah, it looks like it's pretty close. So we might grab about 3,000, 4,000 liters of straw. If we end up selling the building with straw in it, I don't care about that. It's not worth that much. Let's go 3,000 liters of, I guess, sorghum or corn. We'll do corn. Close enough. We'll start with that. We need a little bit more. We can always get more. You want to go ahead and grab some... Uh, Sorghum while we're at it, or something, either sorghum or barley, whatever. Looks like about maybe 5,000, 6,000 liters, something like that. We'll, see, we'll do 5,000 just to fill up the chickens. That's right, 10, 55, we'll do barley.
It's the best time to sell the uh, tiny bit of oats we've got. December, so next month. Close enough. I see you over there. What are you stuck on? You're just stuck on being dumb. <laughs> well, then stop. <laughs> oh, goodness. They, they, I find humor in those things all the time because they're so dumb sometimes. Uh, I forget. Does that drop off over here, too? Yes. Technically, the next thing we'll sell will be honey. Won't be that much, but we'll leave this thing over here by that. All right, looks good. Um, anything else we need to do this month? I don't think so. Let's double check. The weeds got all done properly. Oh, no, we did miss a corner, so let's grab that real quick. I'm going to put a cut in here. I'll clean that up uh, between episodes. And when we come back, we'll be ready to fast forward. And again, here in about two months, we'll probably be getting the bigger pigsty. So uh, that'll be good to have. So I do appreciate you guys watching. May God bless you. And I hope you join me again next time. Thank you and goodbye. I wanted to give a special shout out to the following channel members. Thank you so much for supporting the channel.